Ginger. And now, here's the host of Get the Picture, a guy who comes completely assembled and ready to use, my buddy, Mike. to get the picture the show where an eye for detail can make you a winner we've already shown you portions of our first picture we'll get you up to speed by revealing the rest of it buzz in when you know the answer it's worth 20 points let's see it now yes orange team is it a football is it a football it is a football there you go. Orange team puts you on the board with 20 points. And on the orange team, we have Carlos and Tiffany. Welcome. <laughs> now, Carlos, I understand you want to be a movie director. Yeah. Do you have a, a, a way you practice this? Yeah, I go over to my friend's house because he has a video camera and we shoot movies there. And who's usually the stars of these movies? Both of us. Both of you. Okay. <laughs> and Tiffany, you like to dance? Yes. And what type of, uh, do you take dance classes? Yes, I do. I take tap and ballet and jazz. Do you have a favorite? Jazz. Jazz. All right. Jazzing it up. And on the yellow team, we have Aaron and Andy. Aaron, now you have quite a few hobbies. Tell me about some of them. Oh, well, I like to swim. I like to go bike riding. I like to roller skate. And I play piano. And I'm play the flute and band. Holy smokes, and you find time to practice all these instruments and yes. spot fun? Great. I like it. And Andy, I understand you like to collect uh, baseball cards. Yeah. Do you have a, a special card that's the favorite in your collection? Yeah, my Daryl Strawberry's rookie. Daryl Strawberry rookie card. That must be worth a lot of money, huh? <laughs> yeah, well, it will yeah. be in a few years. <laughs> Andy, just give me old, huh? Yep, yeah, let's hear it. Let's hear it for our <laughs> players today and get the picture. <laughs> ha, ha. He's just thinking about how much it's worth. We're playing Connect the Dots in round one. We'll put a bunch of dots up there on the board. Those dots represent a picture. I will be asking questions. The team that buzzes in first with the correct answer gets 20 points, gets to connect the dots in a square of their choice, and a chance to guess the picture. Let's put our first picture up on the board. There you have it. The clue is it's a thing. Here is the first question. What number pencil do most standardize? Yes, Orange Team. Number two. Number two is correct. That puts 20 more points on your score. Pick a square, please. Number 10. Number 10, please. There's some detail for you. Now, if you guess the picture correctly, it is worth 50 points. If you guess incorrectly, you lose 20. Would you like to take a guess? No. no. Next question. The Endeavor is NASA's newest one of these. Yes. Space shuttle? Space shuttle is correct, Orange Team. Put your score to 60. Pick another square, please. Seven. It's number seven, please. Power surge! A Greg power surge! Everybody, Greg Powers. He always wanted me to say Greg power surge, so I just did. Okay, chance for you guys to get an additional 20 points. Points. Also, if you're successful, we'll reveal an actual portion of the picture. When we get back up there, you can take a guess. This is called It's Raining Pictures. We've broken up pictures into chunks. Well, they're going to slowly fall into the monitor wall one layer at a time. We need you to guess five of them in 30 seconds. Good luck. 30 seconds on the clock for the orange team, please. Roll the pictures, please. What do you see? Pick me. Uh, uh, beach. beach. Beach, good. Next picture. What uh, do you see? A lake. Nope. A ocean. Nope. It's an uh, animal. A tiger. A, a tiger. A, a panda horse. bear. A, pa a bear. Nope, it's not uh, a bear. A grizzly uh, bear. Nope. A, 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 a donkey. Donkey, good. Next picture. Uh, a rope. A, nope. A tennis racket. A basketball. A basketball hoop. Good. Next picture, please. No, nope, um, not pretzels. Um, peanuts. No, nope, not peanuts. Something to eat. It's a pie. What kind of pie? Oh, um, um, pie. pie. Oh, no, that last one was pecan pie. I'm sorry you guys weren't successful at that, but let's get up and play more. Get the picture. All right, now, since you guys were unsuccessful at that, we're going to put 20 points on the yellow team score. Yellow team that puts you on the board. We're going to reveal a portion of the picture in the power surge square. Yellow team, you'll have a chance to guess if you wish to do so. Let's do that now, please. Would you like to take a guess? Yes, yellow Pine team. Pineapple? Is it a pineapple? That's incorrect. Next question. Name the 44-year-old Texas Rangers pitcher who recorded. Yes. Nolan Ryan. That is correct, Nolan Ryan. Put your score at 80. I forgot to mention that yellow team, since you were unsuccessful at that uh, guess, we took 20 points off your score. Orange team, please take another square there. Six. Number six, please. 
Just some more detail for you. Remember, it is a thing. It is a thing. Would you like to take a guess? No. Next question. If an island is a landmass surrounded by water, what do we call a piece of land? Yeah. Peninsula. Peninsula is right. Yeah. Wow. Guessing what the next part of the question was going to be. That puts you at 100. Pick a square. Uh, four. Number fourteen. Four. Number fourteen Sorry. or four? Four. <laughs> Number four, please. There you go. It is a thing. Do you know what it is? No. Not no. yet. Next question. In Greek mythology, what winged horse provided transportation for a Greek hero? Winged horse. Yes. Uh, unicorn. Unicorn is incorrect. Yellow team, do you know the winged horse? Pegasus. Pegasus. Next question. If Queen Elizabeth told you that you were five stone, you might think her crown was on a little tight. <clears throat> but uh, she'd actually be talking about what? Five stone. Yellow team. Money. Money. Yeah, I'm sorry, you didn't make it in by uh, the buzzer, but money was incorrect. Your weight is the answer. Next question. Who did the voice of Ringo star in a recent episode of The Simpsons? Yes, Orange team. Uh, um, I don't know. Yellow team. Oh, sorry. Danny DeVito. Danny DeVito's incorrect. Ringo Starr. Ah, a little trick question just for the kids. <laughs> Next question. How many centimeters are in a meter? Yes, Orange team. Ten. Ten is incorrect. <sighs> Yellow team. How many, how many centimeters are in a meter? Twelve. Twelve is incorrect. One hundred. On to the next question. The Sahara Desert is on what continent? Yes, yellow team. Africa. Africa is correct. 20 more points. Pick a square, please. 11. 11, please. Would you like to take a guess? No. No. Next question. Name Madonna's new tell all backstage documentary. Yes, Orange Truth team. or Dare. Truth or Dare is right. You guys are almost fighting to get out the answer first. All right, Carlos and Tiffany, pick another square, please. 14. 14, please. Do you have a guess? It is a thing. No. no. Not yet. Next question. What percentage of each, house, of each House of Congress must vote for a bill in order to override a presidential veto? More than half or a full two thirds? Is it more than half or a full two thirds? Yes, Orange Team. A uh, full two thirds? That is correct, two thirds. <laughs> Put your score to 140. I need, I need you to pick another square, please. Uh, number eight. Number eight, please. A little bit more detail. Do you have a guess? No. no. Okay, next question. <laughs> What's another name for an avocado? Is it. Yes, Orange Team. <laughs> you don't know. Okay. I'll reread the question for the yellow team. What's another name for an avocado? Is it A, an ancient fig? B, an alligator pear? Or C, a crocodile gourd? A. A is incorrect. Alligator pear is the answer. Next question. Where would you most likely find a river delta? At the mouth of the river? At the source of the river? Or in a big red box? At yes, the Alicia. mouth of the river? At the mouth is correct. 20 more points puts you to 160. Pick another square, please. Number two. Number two, please. A little bit more detail. It's a thing. Do you have a guess? No. Next question. Okay, that buzz means time is running out in this round. We will reveal this picture one square at a time till one team buzzes in with the correct answer. This is worth 50 points. You can guess as many times as you want. You don't get penalized for guessing incorrectly, but please wait for me to call on you. Let's reveal these squares. Yes, yellow team. Sphinx. Is it the Sphinx? It is the Sphinx! That's right. Little Egyptian work there for you. Put your score at 70. 70 for the yellow team, 160 for the orange team. That's the end of round one. And we have round two coming up. That's right. We have got round two, and these guys are going to be playing more. You stay with us. We'll be back in a flash. Welcome back to Get the Picture. Round two set to begin. 160 for the orange team, 70 for the yellow team. In round two, we will be playing a game called Dots. Put another picture up on the board. I will be asking questions that will require two, three, or even four answers. The team that buzzes in with the correct amount of answers gets 40 points, plus as many lines as there are answers, plus a chance to guess the hidden picture if we reveal a square. 
There are two power surge squares up there this time, and don't forget, if you can't supply all the answers for a question, the other team can buzz in and steal. Let's put our first picture up on the board, please. There it is. The clue is it's a food. Here's the first question. The Western Hemisphere, previously known as the New World, is comprised of two continents. Name them. Yes, y'all team. North America and South America. Very good. Puts your score to 110. I would like two lines from Aaron and Andy. Two lines, guys. 7 to 8. 7 to 8. And 7 to 12. Okay. Next question. Indiana Jones and his dad, Dr. Henry Jones, are each afraid of an animal. What two icky animals? Yes, Orange Team. Snakes. Snakes and? Lions. Lions is incorrect. Let me read the question for the yellow team. Indiana Jones and his dad, Dr. Henry Jones, are each afraid of an animal. What two icky animals are they afraid of? Rats. Snakes and rats. There you go. Snakes and rats. Put your score to 150. You guys are right back in this game. I need two more lines, please. Two lines. 12 to 13. 12 to 13. And 8 to 13. 8 to 13. Let's reveal that square, please. It is a food. It is worth 75 points if you guess it correctly this time. Would you like to take a guess? No guess. Next no. question. Name three of the letters printed on a shifter of a car with an automatic transmission. Yes. R, N, and D. R, N, and D is correct. We also have L1, L2, and P for park. That puts you at 190. You are now in the lead. I need three lines. 12 to 7. 12 to 7. 17 to 18. Oh, we already have 12 to 7. Oh. So I guess you want 12 17. to 17. I'm sorry. 12 to 17. I should have said 17 to 18. 17 to 18. 18 to 3. 13. 18 to 13. There you go. Okay, let's see that square. It is a food. Do you know what it is? Something you'd eat. No guess. Not yet. Your name is Muffet. You're chilling on a tuffet and enjoying a hearty lunch. Yes. Little Miss Muffet. That's not what we're looking for. Let me reread the question for the yellow team. Your name is Muffet. You're chilling on a tuffet and enjoying a hearty lunch. What two things are you probably having for lunch, miss? Curds and whey. Curds and whey is correct. That gives you 40 more points. Put your score at 230. I need two more lines, please. Eight to nine. Eight to nine. Nine to 14. Nine to 14. Next question. Name the two types of chromosomes, one male and one female, that combine to determine what sex you are. Chromosomes. X and Y. Next question. What two cities are known as the Big Apple and the... Um, yes, New York team. City and... New Jersey? No. No, that's not <laughs> no. what we're looking for. Uh, let me reread the question for the yellow team. What two cities are known as the Big Apple and the Big Easy? We have New York City as the Big Apple. Do you know what the Big Easy is? The Big Easy is New Orleans. Okay. You may want to watch it. Try not to jump the gun on too many of these questions. Name the two ways to score two points in college football. The two ways to score two points. Yes, yellow team. A touchdown and a field goal. I'm sorry, that's incorrect. Orange team. No guess. Safety and a two-point conversion. Next question. Name the two types of intestines inside of everyone. Yes, yellow team. Large intestines and small intestines. That is correct. Puts you at 270. Two lines, please. 13 to 14. Okay. 14 to 19. All righty, let's reveal that square. Power surge. Good job, Aaron and Andy. What we have here is a power surge called Don't Be So Negative. This is worth 40 points. We'll show you photographic negatives of famous people. You need to identify four out of five in 30 seconds. 30 seconds on the clock. Good luck. On your mark, get set, go. Who do you see? She's on Beverly Hills 90210. She's Brenda's friend. What's her um, name? Kelly. Kelly, that's right. Let's go to the next picture. Kelly Taylor. He's a football player for the 49ers. Joe Montana. Joe Montana. Good. Next picture. He's a really pretty lady. Pretty woman. Keep Julia Roberts. There you go. Julia Roberts. Next picture. He's a singer. Used to be a new addition. Billy Joel. No, it's not Billy Joel. Next picture. He's from Big. Oh, Tom Hanks. Tom Hanks, did they get it? Yeah, they got it. Tom Hanks, good job, you guys. Get back up there. We'll play. No, you can get back up there. There, no. You guys, you can get back up there. We got more to play. That singer wasn't 
Billy Joel, it was Johnny Gill, but that's okay. You did get four out of five. We're going to put 40 points on your score. That puts you at 310. We're going to reveal a portion of the picture in the Power Surge Square. That's a mouthful, huh? Portion of the picture in the Power Surge Square? Let's see it. It's a food. Do you know what it is? No guess. No guess. Next question. In describing the popular television program about show business, name the two words ET stands for. Yes, y'all team. Extraterrestrial. I'm sorry, that's incorrect. Orange team, in describing the Extra, pop. Extra. Oh. It's no <laughs> Entertainment Tonight. Oh. We're looking for the TV show. Right. Next question. What four words are they saying when somebody writes S W A K on an envelope? Yes. Soon send as back, send back, send as soon as possible. I'm sorry, that's incorrect. Uh, that's incorrect. That's incorrect. <laughs> Yellow team, we're looking for S W A K on an envelope. What does that mean? Sealed with a kiss. Very good, Aaron. Sealed with a kiss. Oh, I'm glad we got through that question. There we go. That puts 40 more points on your score. I need four lines. 18 and 19. 18 and 19. Two to seven. Lines. Two to seven. Two to three. Two to three. Three to eight. Three to eight. We have two squares. Let's see both of them. There is one. See the other one. There you go. It's a food. Do you know what it is? Cornflakes. Are they cornflakes? Sorry, that's incorrect. You lose 20 points for taking that guess. On to the next question. I, uh, yeah. A, A, A. Uh, name the name three U.S. states that begin and end with the letter A. Yes. Um, a. Yeah. Um. A. Yellow team. Arizona, Ale Alabama, Alaska. There you go. 40 more points. Put your score at 370. I need three lines. Three, three to four. Three to four. Four to nine. Four to nine. 18 to 23. 18 to 23. Let's reveal that square up there. We know they're not cornflakes. No guess. No guess. Next question. Our 35th president's initials were JFK. What three names are those? Yes, orange team. John F. Kennedy. We're looking. What did the F stand for? What did the F stand for? Do you know what the F stood for in John, John F. Kennedy? John Frederick Kennedy. It's Fitzgerald Kennedy. John Fitzgerald Kennedy. Next question. Name two things you, you, you're told not to do before you go directly to jail in Monopoly. Yes, Orange Team. Uh, don't pass go. Yep. Don't collect $200. Very good. 40 more points puts you at 200. I need two lines, please. What two lines are you going to pick? Um, 23 to 24, 19 to 24. 23 to 24. 23 to 24. 24 to 19. Okay, let's reveal that square, please. A potato? Is it a potato? It is a potato. There you go. That potato putting your score at 275 points. Good work. Let's put our next. Okay, that buzzer means that time has run out in our game today. We're, we're, we got 275 points for the Orange Team. Orange Team, you played great today. But our winners today, 370, the Yellow Team. Orange Team. Good work on that last puzzle. That gave you 75 more points. It got you the baked potato, and we also got some other prizes for you. Henry J., tell us about it. For our departing team, any time is right for Hershey's syrup or chocolate milk mix and milk. When you're ready to enjoy great-tasting chocolate or strawberry milk, say Hershey's, please. Plus, who takes you to school for football practice and on vacation, too? Roma does with backpacks, school bags, locker bags, totes, and travel bags. No wonder America's kids want to be Roma kids. And now, here's Mike. That's right, Aaron and Andy are going to the bonus round of Mega Memory. You stay with us because these smiles may become bigger smiles. You stay with us. Back in the class. Welcome back to Get the Picture. We're here in the bonus round of Mega Memory with our winners, the yellow team, Aaron and Andy. We are playing Mega Memory. This is how we play. We'll show you nine pictures for ten seconds, then we will cover them up. As I read off a clue for each picture, you need to hit the corresponding button on the Mega Memory keypad. For the first six pictures you guys get, you get $100 for each picture. 
After that, you are playing for this, Henry J. Mike, today's grand prize package will let you change the course of history with Trog for your NES. Help the dinosaurs battle extinction on 50 fun-filled islands. Trog plus a Nintendo deck and two more hot acclaimed titles. It's Dynamite. And the Gibson Epiphone PR350 guitar, the perfect acoustic guitar for any style of music. Used by pros, amateurs, and beginners from Gibson USA. Get all nine matches and you'll be going to the Rocking Horse Ranch in Highland, New York. A great family vacation located just a short drive from New York City. Includes all you can eat meals, sports, games, and entertainment. Good luck, Yellow Team. And now, back to Mike. Thank you, Henry J. Some pretty neat stuff. And I think you guys might take it home. The theme of Mega Memory is trips. So take a good look, relax. You got 10 seconds to take a peek. Show it to them, guys. All righty, get up there on that pad. I need you to yell out the answers loud and clear. Remember to take turns and help each other out. The, we'll put 35 seconds on the clock, and the clock will not start until I have read off the first clue. 35 seconds on the clock, please. The first clue, here it is. Headquarters of the USA. Go. What number? Eight is right. Rocky Gorge that was carved by a river. Nine is right. Bait up your hook and join the other anglers. One is right. Portable shelter for the great outdoors. Portable shelter for the great outdoors. Five is incorrect. Downhill racing on a cold pottery surface. Two is right. If you care about your smile, make this trip twice a year. Four is right. Visit the birthplace of a movie industry. The movie industry. Three is right. A cascade of water that's a favorite vacation spot. Five, five is incorrect. You'll have to talk to NASA if you want to take this trip. NASA, take this trip. Seven is incorrect. Portable shelter for the great outdoors. No. Okay, you guys did great. The old, we had number seven was camping. That was the portable shelter for the great outdoors. We had number six was Niagara Falls. That was a cascade of water. That's a favorite vacation spot. The moon was, you'll have to talk to NASA if you want to take this trip. But you guys did great. Henry J, tell us what they want. Aaron and Andy, for six matches, you'll split $600 in cash. Nice job. That is right, nice job. $600 in cash. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye. before a live audience at Nickelodeon Studios at Universal Studios, Florida.